Hi, this is Tamika with Pastries Prince and Pie, and I'm here with some happy mail. All the happy mail that I have here are from some small shop owners, and I am excited to show you guys what I got. So the first thing we have here is from Mojo Jojo Plans. Um, and this is her latest, uh, one of her latest sticker books. Check it off. This is my second sticker book from Mojo Jojo Plans. I do have the neutral boxes one. So, um, I was excited to get this one because it has a bunch of checklists and bullets and I love bullet points. <laughs> and so let's go ahead and take a look at it. So first thing is you get a ton of black checklists now i was thinking i was like black checklists aren't hard to find wrong they really are hard to find they really are so these have four five bullets on them um and then these ones here at the bottom only have three and i believe there's six pages of the black ones that's two three four, five, and six. So plenty of black checklists. The smaller ones would work really good in my um, B6 planners. Or if I just have a little small priority list that I need to um, use a checklist for. So there's that, six pages of the black ones. Then here we have red and maroon and two pages of those then we have kind of an orange and then kind of a peachy color here and there's two pages of those then we have the yellow we have a bright yellow and then a pale yellow yellow is hard to come by uh, most of the yellow stickers and checklists and things of that nature that I've used, I've gotten from um, Coffee Planner Mom. So here we have a green and then like a dark green that almost looks black, but it's just a dark green. Two pages of those. Then we have this bright blue, and this is kind of navy bordering on purple here. But next to the purple, you will see the difference. So there's the purple. So you could definitely see the difference. This is a deep purple, and that is more navy. And then you also have like a lavender. Then we have like a magenta color and a pink. Then we have some gray, so we have a light gray and a darker gray color. So those would match perfectly the um, boxes that I have in the neutral boxes. So these are those same colors. You have this lighter brown and a darker brown, which these colors are hard to come by as well. Then you have two other variations of brown. This is more tan. And this one makes me think more of like um, chocolate milk almost. I don't know why I thought of chocolate milk when I saw that. So we've got two pages of that. And then you get into the bullet points. So um, we've got red. This is a very dark maroonish color, almost brown. So several different colors here. And the bullet sheet that I have been using for a long time is almost a lot of the colors are are gone off of that sheet. So these are going to be really handy. So, and then you have those neutral colors. Now these she said were supposed to be more browns, but they came out more mauve colored than anything. So, And then I believe this is the last page. Yep. Yeah. So a total of 3,176 stickers. Check it off, Mojo Jojo Plans. Um, I know she's supposed to re be restocking a lot of her other sticker books soon. So go over to mojojojoplans.com and give her 
a look. So the next um, item that I have is from Jessica at Live Love Posh. Um, so the next item I have is from Jessica over at Live Love Posh. And this is her new Winter Wonderland sticker book. Now, I've never been able to get one of these sticker books. They tend to sell out pretty quickly. And I was on the fence. I was seriously on the fence because although I've seen all of her sticker books, I just kind of feel like some of the florals are the same, but the colors change. Um, so I watched a flip through and I liked more of around 80% or more of the stickers so I decided to go ahead and give it a purchase there are some pages that are not really my thing but I did like the majority of it so let's go ahead and take a look at this her stuff always sells out I've tried to get the stuff restocked everything to tell you the truth I kind of just gave up for a while <laughs> trying to get her sticker books um, but I happened to be able to get this one all right so Here is the first sheet here. These are very pretty. It's lavender with this kind of mint green. I love this combination together. And these are paper stickers here. I love these. Um, and then we have some snowflakes that have coordinating colors. Very pretty. This page is really, really cute. You've got this cute Christmas tree, presents, hot chocolate, deco and candles. Very, very cute. And then here's some florals to match that page. Some roses and um, poinsettias. Then we have this page. It's kind of black and white with some pink thrown in I really love these trees I don't know if I've ever seen a Christmas tree made kind of like that I really like that and I love this whole scene here with the door this is a cute page I really like it and there's some florals to go with that now I'm not a fan of the florals that match it not really a fan of those but there we have that. Then we have this page here with some pinks and teals in it. I love the cookies. They're cute. And then here is another page that matches with that. Love the pine cones. Really cute. Then we have some black and gold going on here. I like the Christmas tree in that galvanized bucket there. And there's some florals to match with that. I love this. It's very pretty. All right. Here is another page of florals. Kind of have mixed feelings about these as well, but they're not too bad. I like this page with the wood. And so far all of these I think have been paper stickers. I don't think any of them have been clear. No, they're all paper so far. All right, here is another page. Very similar florals to the last couple of pages except these are different color palette. I like the addition of the holly and the berries and how they make put, uh, overlay the boxes on those. All right, these florals actually kind of scream fall to me, but they're different. I don't know how I feel about them, but they're different. Right here we go back into some pinks. You got a llama going on there. It's kind of crafty things. And we have these florals. 
And like I said, everything so far has been paper. Here are some ornaments. I'm not a fan of these ornaments. They're very busy. <laughs> I would find it very difficult to do a spread with these because they're so busy and it's like how do you focus on particular colors with them being so busy but they're not ugly they're just very busy <laughs> here we have some nutcrackers in a very bright color palette and florals to match that Here we have some plaids with some like vintage looking Santas, some Christmas bows, and then there's some florals there. I love the lamp post. And we kind of continue that same vibe. I actually like this page better than the previous page. I love the macarons. That's a pretty little scene right there. And we have cookies and hot cocoa and sweet treats. Gingerbread men. Candy canes and peppermints. That's cute. And one year I did a, a candy cane lane theme in my house. Um, and I made all these Christmas crafts and I had sold them and so I welcomed everybody to my candy cane lane. And I found this cute little candy cane mailbox. So when people came in, they wrote their name on a note card and put it in the mailbox. And I did drawings throughout the night, pulling their names from the mailbox. It was so much fun. All right, let me get into some New Year's vibes here. And kind of some florals to match with that. And there are some roses. So going into like some Valentine's Day deco. Then we have some months, December, January, February, at Christmas, Christmas Eve, Hanukkah. We have a few quotes in here, 25th of December. And some holiday bucket list items. And I like that they're all in black. You mean they would go with any of your spreads that you do for Christmas. All right, and that is it from Live La Posh. So like I said, this was her latest Winter Wonderland. I was very shocked that I was actually able to grab this sticker book. Um, it took me a while to find the flip through because I thought the flip through was going to happen a day or so before it did. And I, I couldn't find it. So I was just hesitant. Like I'm not buying it without looking at the flip through. But like I said, I'm not a fan of every single sticker page, but I like the majority of them. All right, so let's see what else we've got. All right, up next we have the October Oso Paper subscription. So this subscription is called Good Girl Gone Bad. So here's the sticker of the month. They look so cute and tough on their bike. <laughs> I love it. And then here is the coordinating magnet. Look at them, y'all. Now, y'all know when I look at these also paper subscriptions, I can't help but say the word cute like a thousand times. All right here is the postcard. I love it. Look at her tattoo. <laughs> I'm loving her hair. And then there's the postcard, go bold or go home. Adorable. Adorable. And there's a sticker book, and we'll get into that in a second. But here is the mystery item. So this is the last subscription that will have a mystery item. There will be a lot of changes to the subscription starting next month. Um, everything is going to start being stationary and planner related. There will not be any um, 
mystery item going forward and nothing will ship out in December either. So you won't be charged for December box. Um, so let's take a look at this and we'll look at the stickers in a second. So it says either I will find a way or I will make one. So must get done today, would like to get done today. If it happens, it happens. One day, one week, one task at a time. All right, so this is like a daily planner, I guess. So you could probably put your date or whatever up top. Okay, so it looks like each of the pages are exactly the same. Yeah, all the way through. So this is just a little daily planner. So this would really work if you have like a really busy day. And then you can fill this out. And try to get as much done as you can if you're dealing with a, um, a very busy day. All right, and now let's take a look at the stickers. Again, we have girls gone bad. I will zoom in a little bit here. All right. So here we have Mia. Love her. She's got this like belted shirt dress. Cute. Then we've got Bess down here with her cute bob and her little crop top and jacket. <laughs> so cute. All right, here's Egypt. Y'all, look at Egypt. Look at her. I love, I love what she's got on. I love her top. <laughs> she's got her little red heels. So cute. And here's Amaya with her locks. Here's Sydney. Sydney looks like she's got on a little skirt and top there. And then Riri with her cute little black dress. They are so stinking cute, y'all. All right, here's our full boxes. Ooh, look at her with our tough dog. And that they all working on the bike, getting a tattoo, biking together. I love it. Born to be a rebel. I think the sticker book was made for me. And then here we have our boxes. Look at that with a spiked collar. <laughs> <laughs> the tire tracks. Oh my gosh, I love it. I love this color palette. So here's like all the washi strips. This one is silver foil. Depending on how you look at it, it might look gold, but it is silver foil. And there's all the flags and the shades of gray and black, and then the pink popped in there. So that's really cute. Then here we've got some clear stickers. I love this. Go bold or go home. Rebel at heart. And then she has some um, holiday stickers for the upcoming month. Here's our little headers. Notes. Notes. Note to self. Payday. And bill due. Those are all unclear. Then we have some more here. We've got the hot pink motorcycle jacket. The spiky heels. Either I will find a way or I will make one. That is me. That is me all day. All right. And here's some little bits with some weekend banners. All the girls together here at the bottom. And our Zoe stickers. Love the long sidebar sticker. And here's some more boxes. All right. And that is all in this month's also paper kit all right so if you are currently a subscriber just know that there's going to be a lot of changes coming up and if you're not a subscriber what are you waiting for these kids are so stinking cute all right let's look at our last item that we purchased all right so i do pr for coffee planner mom and she was recently a part of um the pink planner sale 
So I, that everyone had like 30% off their shops. I believe everyone did. So let's go ahead and take a look at everything that I got in that sale. I got a lot of stuff. <laughs> All right. Let's see. So first, let's look at these freebies. So I have this freebie from Everything But Disc. So she threw in a freebie from another shop. Um, it has this little cute girl. It says game over. She's playing a video game. Game time. Don't be lazy. Planning chores. Read and payday. And then here is my freebie for Coffee Planner Mom. So if you use my code to make a 15, then this is the freebie that you would have gotten. That freebie may be changing soon. <laughs> But this was the latest freebie that I had. All right. So in the sale, everyone received this freebie for making a purchase. So this is in the new Cosmos colorway. Change bedding, coffee in, a, in one hand, a planner on the other. You have two coffees there, quarter box, planning time, and then test your. Okay, so my camera cut off on me. <laughs> but yes, I was showing the freebie that everyone received with the purchase um, at the Pink, Pink Planner sale if you purchase from Coffee Planner Mom. Alright, and if you purchase $25 or more, you received this freebie also in the Cosmos colorway. New releases, coffee time, clean the baseboards, party, important, no spin, and Alexa skipped a Friday. And then you have a couple of boxes. Then if you spent $50 or more um, after the discount, then you received this freebie, which is also in that same colorway. You've got a square box, two half boxes, two quarter boxes. You have a checklist right here. You may not be able to tell, but there are three bullet points there and two habit trackers. And this was exclusive just for that weekend, all of these um, freebies. But this was really exclusive to that sale, which was the $75 freebie. So here you've got a full box. Here you've got a full box. Quarter box, habit tracker, checklist, checklist. There are four bullet points there. There's a checklist here, and these are separate little um, labels that you kind of use like as glitter labels if you wanted to. You have the days of the week to do top three, cancel, payday, recycling, trash, stardust, and then weekend. So, sorry, I was out of frame. But yeah, this was exclusive. So again, two full boxes, quarter box, tracker, two checklists. There's four bullets here, the checklist here. These are separate little like glitter-like labels here. And so yeah, those were the freebies. Let's get into everything else. All right, so here, first thing we have here is the uh, classic Christmas deco sheet. So the classic Christmas kit was revamped from last year. So you've got some mistletoe and some bells and ornaments and Santa hats. I have the Thanksgiving deco, which was also revamped from last year. So you've got some turkey, some pie, and some cornucopias. Um, I got a, almost everything, I think, in the Cosmos colorway. So here are the bullets. Here are the checklists. So you have some longer ones and then some shorter ones. I got some scripts. So I got meeting scripts because I have a lot of meetings at work. And I needed another sheet of these. I also got some payday scripts. I never really needed these before, but now that I get paid bi-weekly, it's nice to keep track of that now. And um, all of these scripts are hand-lettered by Brittany. You get a simple script and then a bold um, brush script. And then all the deco is drawn by her, just so you know. So now let's take a look at the Thanksgiving kit. I don't know why, but I didn't get the Thanksgiving kit last year. I don't know why, um, but I did get that this year. And you know, like I said, it has been revamped a little. I'm gonna zoom in a little bit so you can see that better. So you have some deco at the top and all of these 
beautiful full boxes and like I said everything is hand drawn and hand lettered by Brittany if you notice the box here in the middle it has a bunch of like words for war things that you would eat on Thanksgiving so that's what that is and then you've got some quarter boxes at uh, the bottom I just love this color palette a whole whole lot I really love it um, then we have the um, half and quarter boxes and then at the very bottom three smaller boxes that she calls label boxes and you have some more of the deco at the top um, there's more deco here pie turkey cornucopias got checklists on all the colors of the kit two Monday through Sunday boxes two full checklist boxes and then the days of the week have those script Thanksgiving words in the back and then you've got some bullets down there at the bottom and this is how all of her kits are pretty much designed so we've got that cute little weekend banner with the pies on the end and this is the quote page so you have uh, the script page so thankful there's always something to be thankful for Black Friday Friendsgiving happy Thanksgiving when I count my blessings I count you twice and always have a thankful heart these scripts here are um, on every kit in black so these are typical scripts that you might need throughout um, the week important appointment chores birthday dinners towel Tuesday trash night and payday and then you have these headers that um, are always the same but the colors changed based on the kit so that is the Thanksgiving kit so let's see what else we've got we've got the classic Christmas like I said this was revamped so cute and colorful I love the colors of this love the buffalo plaid like I said everything hand drawn and hand lettered by Brittany love this Christmas sweater box there and from what I understand this is the music for Jingle Bells <laughs> So how cute and fun is that? And that's again, quarter boxes at the bottom. You've got your half and quarter boxes. And as you notice, the first set of them will have faded backgrounds of the full boxes. And then the other ones are just the colors of the kit. Checklist and deco. You see, yeah, there was deco up here, some mistletoe some bells on that one so here we've got some of everything the checklist Monday through Sunday boxes full box checklist and the cute buffalo plaid on the days of the week and there's the bullets and here is our script page look at the weekend banner how cute is that We've got Christmas Eve, fall a lot. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. There's no place like home for the holidays. Dashing through the snow. Merry Christmas. And then let it snow. And then there's some deco thrown in there. Your um, scripts and your headers. So that is classic Christmas. I'm going to have to hold off using that, which is going to be hard. <laughs> and here is the Cosmos kit. This kit is beautiful. I love the colors first of all she drew everything so nicely here I just love how this is done look at those full boxes and then she even put in the um, northern lights or the uh, aurora borealis so I love that she did that as well love 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 the colors of this here is our half and quarter boxes page love the colors oh my gosh there's a checklist the darkest nights produce the brightest stars and there's some deco there were no deco on these two pages monday to sunday boxes full checklist boxes and look at the day headers oh they're so pretty and those bullets oh i love this color palette love it love it love it and here we have a beautiful weekend banner with those um, northern lights in there some deco thrown in we're all made of stardust never stop looking up I know with 
I know nothing with any certainty, but the sight of the stars makes me dream. That's by Vincent Van Gogh. And then the universe is amazing. And then we have our scripts and our headers. I absolutely love this kit. And the PR team are going to be doing a collab on that in a few weeks, so stay tuned for that. Here is the um, Galaxy Deluxe Sheet. I had to get this. I thought it was so pretty. Oh, love it. Love it, love it, love it. Like I said, I got everything, I think, for this colorway. So here's the Habit Trackers. Here are the square boxes. I love the square boxes. So I got those as well. And don't forget, I showed you the checklist and the bullets also. And then I got the Christmas Quotes 2.0. So she did Christmas Quotes last year and she did another 2.0 sheet this year. You could get these in the classic Christmas color. Um, but I decided to just get them in black so that they would go with any Christmas spreads that I decide to do. So we have Tis the Season, Merry Christmas, You Filthy Animal. Maybe Christmas, he thought, doesn't come from a store. Maybe Christmas perhaps means a little bit more. And I believe that's from the Grinch. May you never be too grown to search the skies on Christmas Eve. It's not It's not what. what's under the tr Christmas tree that matters. It's who's around it. That's from Charlie Brown. I love Charlie Brown. <gasps> love him. I love him. Ho, ho, ho. Fa, la, la. Candy cane wishes and mistletoe kisses. Meet me under the mistletoe. Deck the halls. Don't get your tinsel in a tangle. And then we have Bah Humbug and Believe. And I love how she mixed the fonts on that one. And like I said, all of these are hand lettered by Brittany. All right, so that is everything I got from Coffee Planet Mom. So there's Christmas quotes, Cosmo boxes, Cosmo habit trackers, Cosmo Deco, Cosmo kit classic Christmas kit. She also has a rustic Christmas which we have our freebies. We have some scripts, checklists, bullets, and some deco sheets. And that's everything from Coffee Planner Mom. Then we had our items from Oso oh Paper and our two sticker books from Live Love Posh and Mojo Jojo Plants. So that was everything that I've gotten in Happy Mail lately. Um, let me know what you think about the Happy Mail before. Have you gotten sticker books from Mojo Jojo or from Live Love Posh? Ha are you a subscriber of Also Paper? And have you picked up any stickers from Brittany? If not, what are you waiting for? All right, you guys know what else to do. Be sure to slay, subscribe, like, and accept the alerts so you don't miss any videos. And I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.